the high-resolution camera on the Perseverance rover peered through the dusty skies of Jezero, or Jezero Crater, revealing vistas that may look familiar, but are found nowhere on Earth, on this episode of Mars Guy. Perseverance landed on the other side of the rugged terrain known as Sita and drove around it to reach the sedimentary rocks of the ancient delta. That coffee can looking thing is its UHF antenna, which communicates with Mars orbiting satellites. The Mascam Z camera used its maximum zoom capability to shoot a mosaic of the distant landscape from this location, roughly 85 meters or 275 feet higher than where it landed. These long-range images really help to show the dustiness of the Martian atmosphere, creating the appearance of veils obscuring the landscape. This scene includes a small but prominent conical hill that is easy to spot in images from orbiting satellite cameras. It's about 10 kilometers away from the rover, but it's the arcing mountain range rising above the crater floor that makes these landscapes alien. Although Earth has been bombarded from space over its long history, it has no craters that preserve such tall mountains. The crater rim mountains in this view rise more than 600 meters, or more than 2,000 feet, above the crater floor. The feature dubbed Kodiak Mesa is an eroded remnant of the delta that's about one kilometer away from the rover. Here's Mars Guy for scale. Some of the clearest evidence that it was formed from delta deposits are the sloping layers known as forset beds. Next to Kodiak are two low hills that may be more of the eroded delta deposits. They show up clearly in the orbital image, which has some data dropouts that appear as green rectangles. Here's the Rose Bowl Stadium for scale and to cover up the dropouts. This view helps to show the similar color of the hills compared to Kodiak and similar morphology. The eastern one is almost one and a half kilometers away, too small to see Mars Guy, but the rover for scale is just visible. So too are large boulders that resemble those shed from Kodiak Mesa. This view also nicely shows the increasing dust obscuration of the hills receding in the distance, topped by the looming crater rim mountains. There's a large conical hill more than 20 kilometers away that looks a bit like a volcano. It has a roughly circular base, as seen in the overhead view, but it has no features that clearly show that it's a volcano. So its origin will remain a mystery at this point. Perseverance arrived in its current location on Sol 477 after investigating what appear to be mudstones. Now it's turned its attention to the finely layered rocks slightly higher up, where it just recently completed a successful core sampling attempt. But that will be the subject of a future episode of Mars Guy.